Hi guys, it's Tuesday time for your Tuesday Tech Tip from Basque. Today we wanted to show you how you can search for books on Tar Heel Reader. If you've never used Tar Heel Reader before, it is awesome and you're going to love it. Uh, we'll show you how to search for books, then how you can download them so that you can embed simple, embed simple support for your communication partners. So here I am at Tar Heel Reader. You can just Google search it and it'll pop right up. When we search, we like to keep it um, rated Let's see, let's see if it'll do any rating so that way you will search for all the books we search for um, reviewed and unreviewed books so you have access to all of them and then you can enter text here to search so you can put in keywords or certain titles I know what I'm looking for I want the are we there yet I want to search for that because that is our theme this week um, you search and then you can go through anything that kind of pulls up that word so I'm just gonna scroll through here and go down here to more books and then here's an awesome one it's are we there yet and it's by caroline musselwhite so it's going to be a good one so um i pick it up you can look through here to see if it's what you're looking for yep it is so i'm going to go back and i am going to go up here to this settings and i'm going to download this because i want to put it into my powerpoint so i can do some editing Okay, so all right, so it downloaded. I have it pulled up now in PowerPoint. So now you can go through and you can do editing. So if you would want to change any of the text or add in some more pictures or pages, you can do that. But I'm very happy with how Caroline wrote this story. So I'm gonna keep it. Dr. Musselwhite did a fine job. But I do want to embed some simple support for um, the communication partners working with the student. And we're gonna do the core word there is gonna be our focus. So I have my chat editor already pulled up here. So if you don't have chat editor um, downloaded on your computer and you would like this free feature, you can search Sotillo website or we have a YouTube video that shows it as well. So I'm going to go home here. I was already doing that job. My computer is going to work for me. There we go. So um, I know the word is under, nope, it's under here and my extra words. So I'm gonna turn on capture feature. I'm going to touch there. Now it is here. I copy to my clipboard. And then I come in here and I can just paste it. So then I can move my there symbol wherever. I like it there. Then I'm gonna to go to the next page. Are we there yet? Yeah, and I'll show you how you can do it with the new voice pass software. Um, again, if you want this download that's free, you can check out our YouTube video on it. So there, I have it right there. I'm going to do a snip for this one. So a snip, the snipping tool I have right there on my computer. This allows you to take like a little screenshot of a specific area. So it's on, I'm going to snip and drag here. I got that, I'm gonna hit copy. And I'll pull up my PowerPoint and then I can paste that again and move that symbol support wherever. So um, I went through and I did this for each page. Then I printed it and it looked like this. So I had my symbol support embedded right on. I didn't have to um, print it and cut it and tape it in. It's right there in your story. But I also wanted to print copies to send home for some summer work. So when I went to print, um, you can print as a template of a book. So we printed that and you could just fold it up and that way the symbol support was right there for parents to use at home when they were reading the book with their child. So super easy way to take a Tar Heel Reader book and adapt it to meet the needs of your students. Thanks so much for watching.